All right, so a screencast on how to do the ping pong ball holder on top of your ping pong parachute rocket. The first thing you're going to want to do is drag a sphere into the work plane, and then you'll want to take it all the way up to 24 steps instead of the default 18. Then once you have that sphere, you can set using your ruler, drag it in, and change it to 43 by 43 by 43 high. Then you'll want to do the same. You can duplicate it and then make this sphere 41 by 41 by 41. And then an important part is you'll want to drop this left smaller sphere down 23 below the work plane uh, using that arrow right there and then you'll want to drop this one also 23 below the work plane so that you'll have a portion of it actually the majority of it underneath the work plane then you'll want to make a hole that's large enough for your um, sphere and in this case, you'll want to drop it down 27. I guess it matters as long as this is large enough and then you drop it 27 below the work plane, you should be okay if it's 27 high. So make it 27 high and drop it down 27. And then you'll be able to put it there and group. And that'll give you a partial sphere. Do the same thing over here. This one was 27 tall and dropped 27 in. So it should work too. Group those. And now we have two spheres, half spheres. Make this one a hole. And then we need to drag it into here and align it making sure that both of these two in the middle are grayed out and in that case we can group them and now if you go up underneath it you can see that it's a hollowed out sphere and we have to keep it in this format so it'll 3d print properly next you'll want to make a cube looks like 28 by 27 by 7 lift it up 13 and then center it, grain out both of these. Then this piece right here will be shared with you. It came off a of thing verse. It's 28 by 27, and it's got kind of a bumpy top that should fit in nicely to the top of your bottle. So we'll want to drag that over. First, we'll want to align the, sorry, group these. Then you'll bring this one over. And you can see it's 28 by 27 by 9.25. And it's lifted 19 above so that you just have this small little bit overlapping. And we'll align those. And now you can see it's nice and smooth and aligned on all sides. Then you'll want to make a cylinder hole that's four by four by however long you want to make it. Looks like I made mine 68. And we'll want to put that through the middle. And in, in order for us to do that, first I need to group these. Then we can drag this in and align them. And you just want to align it this direction. And yeah, that puts it right through where you want to go. It's ready finally to be grouped. and you have a completed ping pong ball holder with a hole through it.